What's up guys, Saka Jowie here. Uh, I'm just doing a new video on, um, basically Jagex selling out. Uh, well, they introduced the Squeal of Fortune, so people could basically buy XP now. And, uh, they just reintroduced something called Customization. So they got this stuff called Rune Coins, which I'm assuming is gonna be the stuff you buy to get this stuff. So, I mean, honestly, this stuff's pretty cool looking, but considering that you're gonna have to buy it with IRL, I don't know, man. I mean, I guess it doesn't really affect whether your gameplay in the game like the if you bought XP up would but it's making you have to pay more than you actually have to so I mean I think it would be cool if there's another alternative to this stuff uh well let me there we go um if there's a new alternative like here I'll clear it all there we go starting fresh so let's go with the feline I mean hmm. that looks actually kind of cool but if they had an alternative to um maybe spending real money on this like, if you could pay a lot of GP or something, that would actually do a lot for the economy, for taking money out of the game. Like, let's say this outfit costs 20 mil or maybe $5. But I'm assuming that it's going to only cost uh, real-life money. So, let's look at, at some of this other stuff. They got Assassin. Oh, actually, man, that looks dope. My chick with her little rack. <laughs> okay, so... Oh, I guess they got, like, Assassin. Oh, you can... Oh, you can get the... You can buy the items in pieces, so... Let's see how this Coliseum looks. That looks pretty decent, I guess. It'll, they don't really have outfits like this on RuneScape. They changed the hairstyle even, too, I think. Gothic. Uh, it's a little bit revealing for a RuneScape character. Swashbuckler? Uh look like a fucking bandit like a highway man or something but I don't know I think it'd be cool for if this stuff comes out for RuneScape to implement a way to be able to spend actual GP instead of real life money on this and the GP would just go nowhere like after you spend it it just disappears like kind of how it's not really the same but if you buy like a maxed cape or something it costs like five mil I have no idea how much they actually cost but I think that would help the economy a lot because the more you take money out of the game, that actually stabilizes it a little bit. That's why if you play World of Warcraft and you use like the auction house, they like tax it, so it like um, takes some of the money out of the game. It'll it makes it so money just doesn't keep um, coming into the game and there's inflation. So let's look at some of the other stuff in this customization deal. Titles of nobility. Oh, which king? Which king? When did I get this stuff? Lord, Lady, Empress. I feel like a f fucking pervert because I got all these girl ones because my character's a chick. Military rank, so I'm gonna go with the War Chief. I, I mean, I like the customization aspect. That's cool, but I don't like the fucking how Jagex keeps milking this money out of everyone, man. It's getting sad. Like, are they not making enough as it is? Oh, wow. The awesome. Sakajo the undefeated, the handsome slash the beautiful. <laughs> Grumpy. <laughs> I think these are already in the game. What's animations? Skill? Headbutt mining. What the hell? Uh Okay. Lumberjack woodcutting. I don't really know how this works. This looks kinda cool. But okay. Battle cry. Deep sea fishing. Are, are these currently in the game? You guys can comment and tell me if they are, because this looks kind of sick. Infernal teleport. Holy shit! What the fuck? Alright, that is dope. Holy... Oh my, are you serious? That is so sick. Oh, that is so fucking dope! Oh shit, assassin teleport. Hmm. Enhanced eye alchemy. Uh, that would, I don't know if that'd be... That'd be kind of annoying, I think. Anyways, um... I guess I'll give this update. Fucking... On, Alright, on the uh, aspects of, like, the stuff that's coming out, it, it's all cool, but just the fact that you're gonna have to spend real-life money on it makes it fucking 
crap, man. I mean, me personally, I, I like the teleports, but, I don't know, I think they should innovate some kind of way so you don't have to pay just straight up IRL for it. I think it'd be cool if you could pay maybe like 10 mil, 5 mil or something and get this stuff. Or maybe loyalty points even. Even though that's kind of like real world trading too or whatever. Anyways guys, um, thanks for watching. Uh, I'm going to be putting out some new videos in a couple of days. Uh, I got a new uh, video series idea that I think you guys are all going to like. Um, for for uh, this video, um, thumbs up if you agree. Jagex is selling out. Um, if you actually watch this far, uh, dislike if you think they don't. If you don't think they're selling out, they're just trying to make more money. But honestly, if they weren't selling out, they'd implement some way to uh, use GP as a way of purchasing stuff instead of uh, real money. So thanks for watching, guys. Uh, I'll see you later. Peace.